want to properly secure the valve and then it's just a case of simply fitting it into its bracket. Simple. <laughs> what are you staring at? I had a teacher at school that was a bit like you. Oh, did you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because all the blokes fancied her, but she liked to pretend she didn't notice. How old are you, Ryan? What does it matter? 25. How old are you? I'm old enough to know better. Oh. Ah, how are you getting along, Ryan? Yeah, fine. He's a very fast learner. Yeah, only because i got such a good teacher. Oh. It's OK, Ryan, I can handle this, but just so you know, in the future, if this man comes in, he's barred. All right, you going to be OK? I'll be fine. Peggy, if he's not gone in two minutes, you call the police, OK? Yeah. So who is he? Oh, it's a long story, darling. You can't just ignore what's happened. How are we ever going to reconcile our differences if you won't so much as even let me talk to He's you? She's got no idea. No, I'm have not you? trying to say I haven't made mistakes. Mistakes? But I always had your best interests at heart. Do you know what a psychopath is, Dad? Now, come on. No, he's somebody who can't tell right from wrong. Look! What have I just been saying? I know I've done wrong. He's somebody who will lie, cheat, say whatever he needs to to get what he wants. I can understand you being bitter, Veronica. You've had some nasty shocks, and I'm not trying to deny my involvement in <gasps> Will you please of... just leave? If you're not acting altogether rationally, it's perfectly understandable. I am being rational. That is why I'm asking you to go without causing a scene. I know about the condoms, darling. Now, I can understand that you don't want that one spread around, OK? So hand on heart, my lips are sealed, but it doesn't mean I'm not concerned, all right? What I'm saying is I'm here, any time, any place, and I still love you very much. You all right? What was all that about? Oh, she's the last thing I need. Well, well, well. Since when? Since about two hours ago. Only a trial, but if it works out, then I'll be able to pay some rent. So are you living at her place, then? Mm, the room's fine. Service is terrible. <laughs> I'll have a large book and tonic, please, bartender. Ice and lemon? Yeah. Why don't you get one for yourself on the other? You all right? I like to keep a clear head. I wouldn't trust him. Don't listen to her. Under all that superficial charm, there's just a little bit more superficial charm. In fact, you're just superficial all the way down, aren't you, Ryan? Well, I don't trust anybody, so we should get along just fine. Five twenty, please. Ryan, do you know how to change a barrel? No. Come on, then. I'll show you. 